and we are back welcome back to the channel my name is lag and this is grounded and today well you know what you you see where we're at you know what we're doing today we are calling in the new game plus infused brood mother i went ahead and saved my game right here so if i die we'll just load back up and go again and again and again and again and again until it is done she's dying today let's go out of the pan and into the fire come on down brood mommy i wonder what our modifiers are gonna be okay this one doesn't seem so bad we could probably do this let's get her we of course have the spicy coltana oh i'm poisoned i don't think so get it off of me okay that doesn't work the way i thought it would let's get her nope want some more oh she's calling in her widowlings here we go Okay, we'll switch over to the uh, staff. We'll try to deal with these guys. Oh, God, excuse you. No, 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 no. Got to heal. Still got a couple more of these guys. Did I see the brood mother just fly up into outer space? Where'd she go? Uh, huh. Br brood mommy? I see you up there got stuck huh that's too bad because your modifiers were pretty good the first four are always going to be the same by the way and then the last one is random and that one doesn't seem so bad that's probably just like attack damage up you're not going to come down are you i'm gonna have to reload my save okay if yeah, that doesn't count as a fail that was not my fault yeah come here oh she's trying to bite me Lock. Oh, God, she got me. No, she didn't. Yes, she did. Kind of. No poison, though. Oh, there comes the little babies. Again, we'll use the staff for this part. Oh, oh, uh -uh, uh -uh. And no. And boom. And is that all of them? Yep. Okay. Now, one thing we got to hope she doesn't do is call down any of the infused uh, babies. Because that would be a problem. They would take a lot longer to kill. Little by little, I'm going to whittle her health down, and we will defeat her. Ow. Sure Got to remember that move she does where she jumps backwards. It's a pain. My turn. Okay, we're not doing so bad. We're not doing so bad to start out with. It looks like she has plus defense on this run, which is probably the best one we can get. Because there are some modifiers where she will just one shot kill you. So this is definitely a good one. I'll deal with her having extra defense. Oh no, she did call down an infused baby. Okay. Well, let's deal with them. Oh no. Not only an infused Widowling, but an infused Orb Weaver Junior. We're going to be at this a while. And block. And fire. Fire. Fire! Yeah, that's gonna take a minute. Oh no! Okay, good, we got her. Man, sometimes the staff sends her flying in the air. Gotta keep my eye on the brood mother and these little ones. Right, let me take a heal. Let me keep shooting these guys until they're dead. Which will, oh no, stop. Oh no, I'm stuck. Stamina's becoming a problem. Oh, there we go. Got stamina back. Ow! Ah. Okay. Heal. Just gonna have to keep shooting. That's all I can do. I mean, I guess I could take out my... Oh, did I get the... Uh, I got one of them? No, I didn't get either of them yet. Okay. Ow! Holy crap, man. Heal. You will die eventually. I promise you that. Blocked. Fire! Okay, Orb Weaver down! Now it's your turn. Hopefully you're close. Yeah, it's close. Oh! Oh, no, 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 no! You... That missed block was pretty bad. See, I don't know what that last modifier is. No idea what that is. Could be trouble. Guess we'll find out. Okay! Wow, she does explosions. This is gonna be a tough one. Probably have no chance of beating her. Ah, no. 
get one of the twiddlings. Twiddlings are down. Go back to attacking mommy. Ow! Good God! All right, I see what happens with this one. If she hits you, it's an explosive hit. Which does a lot of damage, so you have to be pretty perfect on your blocks. I block that. <laughs> I did it. I always miss that one where she back jumps. All right, we got her halfway down. And I blocked it again. It's all coming back to me, Broodmother. Oh, God, she's got... Oh, and the little whittling explodes, too? Come on. No, 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 no. Okay, I made it. I made it through that one. Fire! At least there's not shoe-infused spiders this time. And I'm sure that whittling has, ow, less HP than the Orb Weaver Jr. did that was infused. Oh, come on, I blocked that. Not fair, not fair. I'm calling bull crap on that one, game. Whole lot of bull crap. And that was blocked. Okay, we're in trouble. We're in trouble. Okay, we got a good modifier. No more explosions. I've got to take advantage of this. This has got to be the run. Right, she's about to call it her babies, I'm sure. Yep, here they come. Out with the staff. No infused babies. They're all dead. That was a good one. And here I come. Oh, God. Oops. Come on. Come to me. Locked. No. Fight. Yeah, it's taking me a lot longer to, to uh, get her health down. But I will take that over having to worry about explosions any day of the week. I think we have to get her down to around halfway for her to call in her next batch of children. We are just hoping that none of them will be infused. So far, we have gotten an infused Widowling or Orb Weaver Jr. in each of the times we've tried to kill her. Here we go, time to find out. What do we got? What do we got? Ah, I'm normal. This is the run, baby. The RNG is good on this one. Oh God, oh God. No? Okay, I got the health off. Take another heal. Keep shooting these losers. Got him, oh God. Out with the sword. It's go time. No. I've been Blocked it. Mostly. And block and shoot. Come on. Come on. Well, that would hurt, didn't it? You didn't like that one. I think when we get her down to one third of her health, we'll have one more batch of children to deal with. So she still could call in an infused one. We'll see how lucky we get. So far, this is the best we've done, I think. And everything blocked. Go in for some hits. Oh, here comes the babies. Oh, God. Don't turn your back on the brood, Bobby. Oh, no. Heal. Woo. Okay. We got no infused spiders the entire run. Oh, that's perfect. That is perfect. Got a couple of them down, a couple more to kill. Stay away from me. All right, they're both down. Now it's just you and ow. Now it's just you and me, brood mommy. Oh God, oh God, no! Looks like we've got another doable modifier so long as I actually block. Looks like it might be attack speed or something like that. I don't know what that is. But either way, her health is going down nice and quick. All right, little ones, chill out. Ooh, I got them all in one shot. That was nice. Too bad I'm not, brood mommy. Not today. This is my time. Actually gonna block your attacks this time. Before I was just playing around. This time it's for real. 
Come on! We got her on the ropes, baby. Halfway down. Oh, the babies are here again. Okay. No problem. I've got this. Locked. Okay. Do a little healing. Locking. Shooting. There we go. Good one. Oh, God, my health. Ooh, that poison's doing Oh, no. Oh, no. Can't drink it. Okay. Woo. Hitting all of the buttons. I'm panic smashing. All right, let's heal again. Good God. That poison is doing a number on me. Ow. Okay, we're fine. We're mostly fine. I wonder if her poison is more lethal, whatever that last modifier is. Because my health is just rapidly draining when she poisons me. I cannot let her poison me anymore. Yeah, I'm going through my heels. Jeez. Oh, God, she got me again. Ah, and again. Are we sure my wasp don't, doesn't take away that? Oh, it does. Okay. So it takes... No, it doesn't. It does not. I know the wasp don't takes away venom, but if she's just poisoning me, then uh, it's not going to work. Or does the wasp don't take away poison and she's venoming me? Either way, it's one of those, and it doesn't seem to be working. All in the last batch. I'm ready. I'm poisoned. All I'm in. Okay, here's the last batch. Did we get lucky? Yeah, pretty lucky. I don't see any. Oh, God. All right, just focus up your lagging. You've got this. You don't have this. You don't have it. You might have it. I got that heal off just in time. I was so close to death. I am so close to death still. I am out of heals. Kind of. I still have Waspidote, which will heal me. So I'm gonna use it. I would like to get rid of that last Orb Weaver Jr. Thank you. Oh God. Okay. Okay. Let's do it. I can feel it. I can feel it in my bones. This is the run, Brood Mother. Your reign of terror is almost over. Bow before me! Oh god, I got a little cocky. No, please don't bite me. Okay, quickly! Ah. Okay, we're kind of fine. Oh, she's dizzy! Good night! Oh, come on! We got her! We got her! Yes! Woo! Okay, by the skin of my teeth and a whole lot of healing, we got her. And as you can see, I said those first four modifiers stay the same. They do. But that fifth modifier is the RNG. You gotta get something that's not gonna be explosive, and she even does one that's electric. It's just crazy, and I think this this last one we did, her venom was way more potent. Something was going on there. I just changed my mutation over to the one with Dissection Expert. Let's see what we got. Boy, we got a lot of stuff. We just got six Broodmother Chunks. Four Broodmother Fangs, a Broodmother Venom, a whole bunch of the Web Fiber. Now, this is what we were looking for. Broodmother Infused Ooze. And we got one of those, and it looks like we can research it, so we will. We also got a Science Waffle. This one has Block Stun and Reflect Damage Minor. We also got a Science Crinkle called Effortless, Effortless, Effortless Arrows. Nailed it. Take that, Broodmother. You have been defeated. <laughs> <laughs> well, the good news is, is that we beat the Broodmother. The bad news is, is that was only the Broodmother. Can you even imagine what these other bosses are going to be like? You guys know how we're in a new dimension? That's the story here. Um, the house. I just noticed. It was not red in normal game. I forget what color it was, but it wasn't red. So that's cool. Little changes like that. Plus, I'm not so sure that the bike way over there in the corner had all that color to it as well. I'm just kind of looking around to see if there's anything obvious. And for some reason, that's sticking out to me. So maybe it was, maybe it wasn't. But the house, definitely different color. First thing I'm going to do is come all the way to the back of my house here. And we can use the science station to research that drop that the broodmother gave us. Let's go through the armory and then right up the stairs here. How convenient. This is just right here, ready to use anytime we need to. 
Yep, and now we know how to make a fusion crystal. Also, I did that whole boss fight sitting on five milk molars. I could have been even stronger going into battle. Totally forgot to spend them last episode. Uh, we're gonna put one into health, that'll cost four. Ready. So I guess that means we can make the yoking station now. Where should I put this thing? I was thinking about putting it right here in the middle of the room. We'll see how it looks. And if I need to move it, I will move it. Uh, yeah, this is the center of the floor right there. And I should have everything I need. I need some Supreme Whetstone, got that. Supreme Plating, Deduper Jelly, five of those. And one Broodmother Infused Ooze. Oh my God, look at it. It's been infused with the power of raw science. So if I wanted to take my level nine mighty club of the mother demon up to a level 10, it'll cost me five fusion crystals. We will go from plus 65% damage and 65% durability all the way up to 90. Wow, that is a big increase. I like that. And a fusion crystal, oh my God. It costs three broodmother infused oozes and three de duper jellies if you wanna make it that way but it looks like there's a second way we can make it oh thank god okay infused ooze plus to duper jelly i can craft three of these total i still need to craft two more so i'm going to need a total of 10 more de duper jelly actually nine more because i have one available and i'm going to need four more infused ooze huh well it looks like we're not going to be doing you today but i am going to try something we're going to go back to the queen ant and we're gonna try to poison her. I wanna see if, now that I've befriended her and I've got the mutation, can I kill her and get the parts from her now? And obviously it won't take back the mutation, so I think it's fine to do this. I just don't know if you can during the same New Game Plus. Meaning, once you make a choice, are you stuck with that choice for the entire New, ga new Game Plus? Let's find out. I was on the fence at first, but I definitely kind of like this sitting in the middle of the room. It's a good centerpiece. I think what I'll do is while that's cooking, go to bed and get our buff and make it morning time. Good night. All right, let's grab the poison mushroom sandwich and we'll start heading our way over to the ant hill. I do want to make a quick pit stop inside of the oak lab and use the deduper machine so I can get rid of one crinkle that I don't want. And what I can do between episodes is go and farm the brood mother a few times so I get some more of her infused goo. Plus whatever crinkles I don't want, I can dedupe them for the deduper jelly. And by the next episode, we should be able to upgrade the Club of the Mother Demon. But for now, I'm going to get rid of this effortless arrow crinkle. He duping! Something else you should know if you don't already. If you don't like a crinkle, this one's got plus gas guard on it. And you want it to have a new ability on it. All you have to do is duplicate it. But it's going to cost you 10,000 raw science to duplicate the science crinkle. And there is no guarantee of getting something better than what you're trying to get rid of. So you better have a lot of raw science once you start playing around with that. Okay, let's make our way over to the anthill. I just hear a moth. I think there's a moth up here. Oh, you know what? I've got a thing right there. Let's climb up it. There's definitely a moth on top of this. And there's some raw science on top of it as well. Yeah, I built this during my other playthrough so we can come up here and get a scabby probably. I certainly hear a moth. Moths were never over here, and that's one of the things I've got to get used to. They have moved around some of the locations where some of the creatures can spawn at, and right here definitely is a moth. I'm hearing its cute little chirps, or whatever you would call that. Noises. Chirps are what birds do. Well, this is very high, and I do not have a dandelion tough. Oh yeah, there goes the moth. Oh, there's also a milk molar up here. Shut your mouth. Sure how to jump up here. Oh, so close. I feel like this is how you do it. And so I shall do it. You jump. Got it. It's a good spot for a milk molar. I would have never even thought to come up here and check if it wasn't for that moth noise. But there was also raw science up here, which my scabby did detect. So I would have certainly come up here eventually for that. Well, I can get its attention with an arrow and then we'll switch over to the sour battle axe because I'm pretty sure this guy is weak too sour where show me your sour yep sour fresh spicy got a few weaknesses yeah i know oh you're right here i don't even have to here we go 
sorry about that. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You're so cute. I'm so sorry. Please don't. No. Okay. Come on down here. Come on. Don't do your dust cloud thing. It makes me bleed, and I don't like it. Nice try. I need you to get closer, though, because I can't reach you. Get closer. All right, come on. This one's smart. Staying away from me. Maybe I'll switch over to my arrows. Huh? You're making me do this. This could be over a lot quicker if you just come in. And face me like a man. A Mothman. Uh-oh, watch out. Woo! I like that pole being there. That's pretty helpful. Well, you are done for, Moth. Got her. Him. Where'd you go? Uh-oh. Where's the body? I need that. Better stay away from that orb weaver. I hear you down there. And then down on the handle. And then jump on my ramps. And we're down. Now where is it? Oh, it's on that. Okay, I'm going to have to parkour a little bit. Where's that orb weaver? It's over there. Okay, mind your business, orb weaver. This is between me and the moth. And we run and we jump. Okay, we'll just do it this way. This seems pretty easy to do it this way. Let's get the parts. Sweet, moth fuzz, three. I need five more, I need two more moth fuzz and I can make the science rug. Okay, now this time, let's head over to the red anthill. Honestly, this time. Why is there hot cha-chas inside of the mint box? Did they change the name of hot cha-chas to Hex? This is Heckman's Forsaken Spicy Bits? <laughs> why is the, why did they change the name? I wonder if there was an, a candy in real life called Hot Cha-Chas and they got a little cease and desist letter. I have no idea. Why would they change it? All right, I'm going to get these and then we're going to the red anthill. Promise. There she is, the anthill. I have my mutation on, so they shouldn't bother me. Should be good to go right on in. Excuse you. What's going on out here? And we've got infused ants everywhere. Step aside, ant. I'm here to see the queen on official business. I am her best friend. You all can trust me. I am totally not here to destroy everything you hold dear and near. And certainly not go back on my word of friendship with the queen. How do I get to her? Can someone point the way, please? Yeah, she's in here. Okay, that's better. All right, it's time to... Oh, can I get more pheromones? Yes, I can. Sweet. Guess we can come back in here every few days and get pheromones, so long as she's our friend, which... We're about to find out if she's going to always be our friend during the new game plus that we're currently on, or if we have to wait to the next one to poison her. You know what? It says right there, already fed. So that answers my question. We cannot do anything else with this red ant queen during this new game plus. Oh, I got behind her. I snuck behind her, but the wall's here. She has to die in this wall of crumble and you can get to all the goodies behind it. Well, let me tell you something, ant. I'm a little disappointed in that. I really wanted to kill you. Have my cake and eat it too, as they would say. But today is your lucky day. But perhaps in another dimension, it won't be. 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 So now I've really got to decide what to do with the next two. I should definitely kill the black ant. I think that's what I should do. I should kill the black ant because the black ants, I'm not going to be dealing with that much. Yeah, you got the whole black ant hill with the black ant lab, but you get through that. When do you ever see black ants again, really? On top of the picnic table and on top of the tool shed. That's it. So if I kill the black ant queen, maybe I can get some black ant parts and learn a new recipe. Uh, like maybe a new armor set or something. I don't know. And then if I'm interested in playing a new game plus two, I should probably infect the fire ant. And then a new game plus two, it'll be infected. I can kill the infected version of it and it'll drop me infected parts and I can make some infected stuff. But by making the fire ant the victim of infection, that means all of the fire ants in that hill are going to be infected in new game plus two, which means they're going to be really hard, even harder than they would be in new game plus one as infected. So it's a tough choice. I got a lot to think about before I decide what I'm going to do with the next two ant queens. And also the possibility is still there that I could just befriend all three of them in this playthrough and then forever be the ant king with that mutation. Then I really don't have to worry about how tough they are in the future because I'll be their friends whether they're infected or not. Well, that was a rough day, but we got it done in the end. We beat the infused brood mother in new game plus and she is tough especially depending upon what modifier she has. But we did it anyways. We also came across a moth and took its fuzz. Found out that you can only do one thing to the ants 
in New Game Plus. So we have to wait for the next New Game Plus if we want to do anything different to the Red Ant Queen. So hopefully you guys enjoyed today's video and you learned something new. And if you did, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel if you're new. And as always, this has been your boy Lagan24. And I will see you uh, next time.